I don't need therapy, I got a Corvette. Dang, man. I haven't seen that new Mustang since second gear. Is that him, that little dot way back in the distance? My wife says, That Corvette is just an extension of your penis. I looked her dead in the face and I said, I wish. Whoever said money can't buy happiness, they have never owned a Corvette. Pinky in. Anytime you're getting ready to go for a drive, there are certain things you need to bring with you, such as drag racing helmet. This is the way. I don't always downshift, but when I do, I make sure to rev match and it's right next to a Prius. Daggum, them things are stupid for two oaks. Yeah, I got my extra new balance right there. All right, I ain't gonna lie. There is absolutely no graceful way to get in or out of these. You kind of fall in and then fall back out. And with my trick hip, I always picture Jesus Christ driving a Corvette because I could see him just banging gears and laying Hellcats left and right. Got to turn and then just kind of drop. Why did I buy a Corvette? Well, that's really simple. Cheaper than therapy. Shut on both of my balls in the Frank Burner. Oh, mother of God. Heck of a lot cheaper than marriage counseling. That gum. I got my really good Hawaiian shirt to the side. What did the Honda owner do immediately after beating a Corvette in a drag race? He turned off his Xbox. <laughs> I dribbled a little bit. Corvette, the number one provider of gap insurance. That gum. Where's my AARP card? You want you want to race? All right, I got you. I got you. Let me get on my helmet. This is the way. This guy in a Prius says to me, I get 55 miles a gallon. What do you get? I looked him dead in the eye and said, I get respect. Your original window sticker, because everybody needs to know exactly what you paid for the car. Nice parking, Bobhead. What do you mean? This is a Corvette. I'm supposed to take up two parking spaces. If this was a BMW, I'd be parked lengthwise, taking up five. All right, I bought this car used, but it's important they know that it was expensive at one time. Tax refund? Do you mean the annual Corvette parts stimulus package? <laughs> Tire shine is a must. You gotta keep them super shiny. Where do Corvette owners take everybody for dinner? That's simple. Gapple bees. Waterless car wash and microfiber towel. She at all times needs to be luxurious. All right, now the not so fun part, the getting out. Oh man. And luscious. Ooh, she's already voluptuous, aren't you, baby? Yeah. Love you. Mmm. Need a shoehorn. <laughs> Whew, that was graceful. Hello, ladies, come look at my Corvette. I went to my first AARP meeting, and it was strange because it was all the same members as my Corvette club. Hey, check it out, y'all. This is one of five made this year with this color, this thread count on the carpet, and this color of coolant. This one's rare, come check it out, come here. I don't need Cialis or Viagra. I got me a Corvette. Mm, baby. Need a lounge chair. Gotta bring one of these with you. Corvette owners, we don't need GPS. We just follow the sounds of our engine all the way to Cool Street. To be fair, I don't really know how to use a GPS. The kids are coming over this weekend and they're gonna show me. Looks like I forgot to bring my walker though. Yep, you seen that right. My hair's in a man bun because I'm about to show you also what them Subaru boys is like when I borrow my son's Subaru WRX. Man, they are all kinds of goofy. And December 2024, I am donating my hair to Locks for Love. So join me for that, it's a good cause. Daggum. <laughs>